The 8th district in California is magical. You have the snowiest town, the highest peak, Death Valley, the lowest point. You have forests and mountains and rivers and lakes. You have the Mojave Desert. This district has almost every ecosystem you can imagine and each one is so special in its own right. Today, Earth Day, I'm launching my campaign to represent California's 8th Congressional District. We're going to use the opportunity to go all the way from Lee Vining down to Joshua Tree National Park. It's a place of incredible environmental treasures. I went to Washington, D.C. to help save the Affordable Care Act. Then I went back again to protest putting children in cages. And I've learned that the only way to make the change is to have a fighter in Washington working for the people of their district. It's important to stop in Bishop both to talk about how important this community is, the threat that it faces from things like wildfire. I mean, we're just seeing more and more fires and more extreme fires, and we need someone to go to Washington and fight for all the areas and the people who make their home and living here. Just 40 miles to my left is the ancient bristlecone pine forest, the oldest living trees on earth. Just to my right is the Palisades Glacier. And if we don't get our act together, these natural treasures will disappear. What are your biggest concerns? Seeing right now the conditions compared to when I was little is just severely, severely different. It should not be an argument if people believe in global warming. It's not a matter of being a Democrat or Republican and we need to address each one of these issues, not only for the California 8th, but for our country and for the world. This used to be the Owens Lake. This was the second largest lake in California. When the Owens River was diverted, it took 15 years for this to become a dry lake bed. It takes a long time to undo really bad environmental decisions. We all saw what happened in Joshua Tree during the government shutdown. Joshua trees were cut down, people couldn't work. There were delicate ecosystems that were destroyed and are going to take hundreds of years to come back. We are going to need a lot of support to get someone to Congress who's going to be able to stand up and have the political courage every day to protect these places. People of this country need to see what is at stake and I will work as hard every day in Washington as you saw me work today for this district. I'm Chris Bubster and I'm running for Congress to represent California's 8th Congressional District.